Hello YouTube, um, what I'm going to be showing you right now is how to add a recovery flasher to your Android device. I will be doing it on the Dell Streak. Uh, keep in mind that um, clock work mode works on other devices, uh, other Android devices, and Streak mod uh, works for, for the Dell Streak. Uh, if you try using clock work mode, uh, it does not work. It did not work for me. It only gave me the recovery boot logo and looped it around several times. Now, let me just get to it. <clears throat> what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to get your phone and go ahead and remove the battery from it and wait for at least five seconds. Then you go ahead and add your <clears throat> your battery back and um, your back cover. And then you're going to need to um, boot it in fast boot mode. And in order to do that, you will need to press the camera and the power button down at the same time and leave it pressed. Now let me just do that for you guys. Now once this boots up, you will get a white screen. Don't freak out. And go ahead and release it. And then you'll be sent into uh, another screen you'll see right now and what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and press fast boot on top and then you're going to wait 10 seconds and add uh, connect your connect your I'm sorry I, ha I don't have my street cord connected I'm sorry uh, anyways connect your street to your device after the 10 seconds now uh, you will need to download just go ahead and press fast boot. I'll tell you in a bit. It gives you a little message on the bottom. Wait 10 seconds. And go ahead and connect your device. Once it's connected, it's going to say fast boot mode. Now that's where you go to your computer. Um, I did provide a link on the bottom for you guys, so download the multi recovery flasher. You will need a RAR extractor. I use Froggy RAR extractor, so uh, that works for me. It's free. Um, so once you have your file extracted, just add it to your desktop for easy access and go ahead and click on it. And you will need to, let me just zoom in for you guys. A little too much. <clears throat> now you will be opening the multi recovery flasher, which will be um, on the bottom for you guys. Not so much on the very bottom, but on the bottom. Go ahead and click it and allow it to run. Now, let me bring this down over here. Once you go ahead and run it, you will get the screen, which actually gives you a selection for Dell Streak uh, recovery flashes. Uh, you'll have, uh, depending on your model and whatever recovery flash you want to do. And uh, you will, will be using the Flash Streak Mod recovery. It does, uh, it does say that the, um, it has been reported that the Clockwork Mod works. However, when I tried it, it did not work and it gave me the little loop around. So I suggest, I really recommend SR. And uh, just a little disclaimer here, um, I'm not responsible if your device is in either, either in any way damaged. Um, that's just something I'm supposed to put on the bottom or something, I don't know. Anyways, um, on where it says select, you can pick the one you want, as the one I want is flash streak mode, depending. Uh, for you guys who have um, other Android devices, just go ahead and use clockwork mod. That seems to work on other devices, but not on the Android. Um, on the Dell Streak, I'm sorry. So the one I want is SR, so I'll go ahead and type in SR. And I'll go ahead and click Enter. Once I click Enter, it's going to give me this. And it'll say, press any key to continue. You go ahead and press it, and then it'll give you um, the same kind of like deal. It says, press any key to continue. You press Continue. And once you're done, uh, it'll bring you back to your original. On page and your phone will be rebooting. Once that's done, you just go ahead and close this out because you already have it. Um, and we'll go back to the phone. I do have a custom ROM on my phone, so um, 
uh, it, I do have the streak droid so I'll go ahead and um, do a video on how to the process on how to install streak droid or custom ROM you can install streak droid or Modaco um, I heard Modaco is real fast however I don't really like the little interface it has and Street Droid is actually pretty stable right now I've had no problems now it does have a couple updates which you don't need to worry about because it doesn't matter right now anyways um, totally went into the Street Droid recovery thing yet. I don't know anyways uh, once you have that done you're gonna go ahead and power up power down your phone shut it down and I'm just gonna show you uh, what exactly the recovery flasher is and uh, what it will look like which is completely different from the clock mod road clock work mode recovery um, if you guys had the previous version IDK uh, anyways in order to start uh, your flasher and get it in flash mode you're gonna go ahead and press your power button and your volume up and down rockers at the same time leave it pressed until it powers on go ahead and release and then press uh, power again and then it will bring you to this little settings right here you're gonna go ahead and uh, select by doing the little hour the little volume rockers um, I mean to move the little highlighted things to move the volume rockers then you're gonna go to software upgrade via update package on SD and you're gonna go ahead and click your camera button your camera button is for selection and um, once that's done it will give you a little this little page thing don't freak out uh, you, you did not block your phone uh, all you have to do is press the power button again and right here you'll have a little I forgot to talk for a second. Right here you'll have your options to apply SD card update zips, stuff like that, uh, factory reset, and stuff like little tidbits that you could use. Uh, this will be very important for you guys in case you want to add a custom ROM, so just a little FYI. And that's it. And that's how you add a flash recovery. So I'm going to go ahead and select reboot settings. And that's it. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, I will be doing my other video on how to add the district droid, um, and which basically involves the Modeco ROM and stuff like that. So that's it. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and y'all have a good day.